Hey you right guys, Trophy Reacts here and today we are watching and reacting to episode 21 of the OC season 1. Last episode we had, what did we have? We had the whole case kind of going on with Sandy now so that's going to be I assume the, season, uh, the story for the rest of the season with that. I hope there's more to it but it seems like they've kind of set up pretty well just to give Sandy a bit more of his own storyline um, and then Kirsten could kind of be involved with that as well. Then we've got the drama with Ryan and Marissa still going on and Team Th Teresa but that's fine i've not uploaded the last no i've uploaded the last episode to patreon i think most people are like agreeing but also a lot of a few people were saying like they shouldn't be like oh this is unfixable kind of thing with marissa and ryan like i don't think it's unfixable um, but i do i would be surprised if ryan just jumped straight back into her arms like instantly after all of that i think she was i think marissa was fine up until like the episode where she found everything out and uh just dumped him and then said she couldn't trust him anymore and stuff i think that like that's gonna hurt um especially for ryan when you think like he's probably been around people all his life who just don't have the trust with him so i kind of had that with marissa and then lose it so quickly uh and be gaslit by everyone the entire because even seth was doing it and sandy it wasn't just marissa but uh yeah anyway episode 21 guys if you enjoy make sure to leave a like because it does help the video and it does help the channel and patreon is down below if you do want to join us over on there we should be let me uh i think we'll be yeah we'll be a few episodes into season two by the time this one's on youtube so like i say that'll be down below but for now guys let's do this what, uh, what kind yeah. of kiss was it i don't know a kiss my lips Teresa's lips a kiss oh he's, i love how these two just tell each other as soon as it happens no but just tell me this what sort of level of kiss are we talking about it was it like a like a christina madonna pack or was it like a britney no uh, it was it was a kiss Full on kiss. Like a, like a Alan Tipper Gore lip lock. It's just a kiss, okay? Okay. So you guys a couple now? Ryan regretting bringing this up. So then what? She's going back, and if so, what are you going to do? Are you going to commute back and forth from Chino? And if you're commuting, whose car are you going to take? How are you going to pay for gas? How are you going to do that? What freeway? Wow. <laughs> the thing is, you guys kissed, and I think you should have a plan because it's kind of a big deal. No, it's not a big deal. Just make it a big deal. Really? Really? I mean, I don't even know when I'd see her again. Hi! <laughs> Teresa, well. hey. Hey. Morning off. I thought you guys might need a ride to school. Oh, yeah, great. Yeah. I hope it's okay me stopping by. It's fine, come on. Yeah, sure, why wouldn't it be? <laughs> oh my god. Marissa! Where Teresa is, Marissa's always three steps behind. Didn't think you'd be. Stan, yeah, well. <laughs> What's up? Uh, nothing, I just thought maybe you guys would need a ride to school. Oh. Right, well thanks for presuming. <laughs> no, she's... I can't try and make out Marissa's evil, she's not. Actually, it makes more sense if you take them. Why? Because we go to the same school? Or because I live here? Marissa, you... Okay. <laughs> with Marissa. I feel like Marissa makes this so awkward. <laughs> it's awkward enough as it is. Uh, I'll just see you guys at school. Yeah, I shouldn't just stop by. I'm gonna go. No, no, wait, wait. It's... Call me later. Well, looks like we're hitchhiking. Oh my god. This whole Marissa, I will say like the Marissa, Teresa, awkward thing. Uh, if that could wrap... Like, I think Ryan just needs to shut Marissa down. Like, I'll give it either this episode or next. If it goes beyond that, then it's going to start to be like, okay, come on. <laughs> we're, we're, we're figuring it all out. Well, is she, is she going to, what, rent a place? What kind of lease? Month to month? Oh my god. Can she afford they must have planned this before. So is my dad going to be in a good mood? Well, he should be. It's man of the year. I meant the case. <laughs> man of the year. <laughs> I'm thinking about it. It's just, we're going to host a reception here for my dad's award, and it would be nice if Uncle Sean could be here. Not if we have to pay for the bartender. Who actually likes Uncle Sean? Oh, my God. <laughs> yes, Luke. Hey. <laughs> completely different guy. Well, I won't say completely, but this was always in him. We were just waiting. When you and I broke up and uh, I started dating Ryan, was it hard for you <laughs> yeah, to I see think us it was. together? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> but hey, we wouldn't have broken up if I hadn't deserved it. I guess now I know what it feels like well, huh? yeah. to deserve it. What Marissa did, I don't think it was as bad as Luke, but. <laughs> the sooner you realize that it's never going to go back to the way it was, the sooner you can move on. Ooh, Lucius. How long is she staying for? No, oh, she's uh, got another job, place to live. Minor details, huh? Yeah. Well, if you need any help. Oh, thanks. Oh my god. Dead chemistry. Dead. It's dead. It's done. Check out 
Graham. She looks so angry. That's because he is. I don't know why. He's on the cover of a magazine. It's hard to believe that doesn't leave him happy and fulfilled, right? Totally. I know. Monica. Wow, Diana Khan totally got a chin implant. They have chin implants? Oh, yeah. My dad does them all the time. He says chins are the new nose. So did Picasso. Chins really? Are the new what hospital does he work for? I mean, back 20 years ago. I'm leaving. You getting this? You better not. No. I'm going back to Pittsburgh. What? I'm going to go live with my yeah. aunt and uncle. I just kind of had enough of Newport, so. I'm leaving. Great. They, they basically were like, oh, we don't know what to do with Anna now that Seth was summer. It's not like she could just be her own character, so she'll leave. I'll do my head in if she actually leaves. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Uh, Marissa stood right behind him with a shotgun. If it was some right turn pretty, he'd turn around and Marissa would be there. Caitlin, hi. Hi, Luke. Oh, is that still Shailene on? Woodley? Well, I just uh, finished school for the day, you know, which is always a good thing. I so know what you mean. Yeah, it is. You can see it on her face. Luke, what are you doing here? We're talking, Mom. I can't believe that Shailene Woodley. That hurts my brain. Because it doesn't even feel that long from when this aired to when Divergent was, but then it is. It's like 10 years later almost. It's just, what was that, 2013? Divergent was or something? Oh! Oof. Jules? Luke? Luke just came by to defrag my hard drive. That was okay. way more suspicious. Very long, Luke. Make it quick. I'll make sure Caitlin's ready. Uh, Luke just came here to... You know what? It's about time someone started to actually get, like, a sense that something's going on, actually. It's not like I'm rooting for them to keep it a secret. It's like... You're in high school. <laughs> she should be. You're both in way over your heads. She's got no real job. She's got no place to live. And please don't ask me if she can stay here. I wouldn't. Good. Because you have no idea what Kirsten did the last time I floated such a concept. <laughs> yeah, well, she came around. You gotta tell her. It's time she faced the music. Or at least the fiancé. Yeah, probably that. I do agree with that. But I don't agree with her going back to Chino because then we'll, she'll be gone. Mr. Nickel? Why don't you call him Caleb? He's not going to do that. Caleb didn't like that. Congrats on your award. I mean, it's nothing. Oh, I was thinking Chardonnay for dinner. Nah, I get the peanut. Do what you like. It's your house. I'm just making a salad. Hey, that's Man, what you're doing, Caleb. Here, it's still so modest. <laughs> I'm so glad to see it hasn't gone to your head, Cal. Uh, I love that he matches him. She is already implicated without her knowledge. Then why worry her? This may all go away, you know. It may not. And I won't spend the next year lying to her. So if you want my help, yeah, you I respect that Sandy cheeks, Sandy boss man. I just got off the phone with Eddie, uh? and I told him I'm not coming home anytime soon. Okay, well, I'm sure. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> I say I'm sure he'd love that. I did. I feel so much more free, or something. <laughs> what do you want to talk about? How do you feel about home. Home. Oh. And watch, I'll have dinner and Marissa will come over. Totally self-absorbed. Now I'm not self-absorbed, right, Ryan? Me. Me. Huh? Me. Sorry. Uh, <laughs> thinking about Teresa. <sighs> She's staying. What am I going to do? She's leaving. What am I going to do? This is the, I always had it in the back of my mind when I kept saying uh, the actress's name, guest starring. Samara, is her name Samara or something? So I told she was a season regular, but I thought when season two would come around, it would say, like, she'd be in the credits or something. Breaking and entering. Theft. What else? Blackmail? Racketeer? Murder! <laughs> oh, yeah. Is he going to jail? Not if Sandy can help it. Well, if he can't, are they going to go after you? I'm afraid it's not just me. Oh, oof. I, th I think we knew that, but... <laughs> Could they give us any more reading? Oh! Hey, what's going on? You know exactly what's going on. <sighs> to be fair, what do you think was going to happen? No. No? Then why would she call me and tell me she's not coming back? Why would she stay here, huh? Hey, huh? All right. Tell, no, don't touch me, man. Oh, After everything God. I did for you growing up, the least you can do is be honest with me. That you be a man and you tell me. Oh, are you sleeping with her? No. Excuse me. He's this actually not, to be fair. And students only. Oh, you tell him, Neil. He did tell the truth there. He kind of avoided to say that he kissed her a couple of times, but... Hey. Hey. It's nice weather we're having. Yeah. Oh, yeah, this is oh, brilliant. Oh, did you hear the Lakers won? Oh, did they? Yeah. Hey, yeah, the they Lakers did. Won. There's something else I wanted to talk to you about, actually. What was it? I can't remember. <gasps> That's it. You're leaving. Why the hell are you leaving? Why are you leaving? I miss the snow. I miss, 
I miss the best times of spring. You miss the season? Yeah, and... Nothing to do with you. The vinyl selection at Record Village. On Sundays, the Super Fleet... Can we get the spin-off Anna show? So that's it, there's not like... One other reason. Did I say peanut butter cup pies? Yeah. Then no. Good, excellent. I think you are a reason, Steph. I don't think you're like... The only reason, though. <laughs> at my house for my grandpa. We can't. Tomorrow I'm leaving. We can't leave without saying goodbye, though. I'll come say goodbye. Okay. Right. This sucks. I don't like this. Look, I'm used to getting what I want. Which I know is not, not the this most season. attractive quality. But I also know that I can't compete with a girl you've known your whole life. Not after everything that's just come between us. Are you calling it quiz now, Marissa, finally? I don't think she has the clothes, the dress. Thanks. Right, you do have to give a little more. She's I don't that but Marissa is clearly trying and laying it all out there. And you're kind of giving her nothing. <laughs> just say you're not inter just say you're interested in Teresa. Just like it's fine. You might be still unsure, but uh he can't keep this going, he needs to tell her. And I will not let you compromise yourself. Not even for me. I'm gonna call the caterers. Make sure that uh there's no cilantro for the man of the year. Seth and Summer. Doing what Seth and Summer do. She's lying, I know it. What? Critic oh, now. Anna. Oh You're thinking about Anna right now? That food does look nice, so I'll take that. I just never wanted to hurt her feelings. Maybe she just didn't like it here. I hear there are a few people. Uh, don't. To be fair, I do kind of like that he's feeling a little bit guilty with how he treated her. Because he did treat a lot of shit, let's be real. I don't know what to do about us. I, I, I can't get you a job, a place to live. I live in a pool house. You could help get her a job. Shut That's. The hell up. Won't be too hard. I don't need you to take care of me. I can take care of myself. I know. Ed is going to bust down the door. Sweet. Sexy. Like these bed covers, like what the hell? There's a lot going on on these bed covers. Doing this. It's not like we have a before. So now when Eddie asks, have you slept with her? Now you can say yes. Oh, did he say not really? Oh, like we had before because it would have. Back when they dated in China. Yes. Ed is out the window or Marissa. I was like an Eddie car if I ever saw one. Yep. They're not the smartest, are they? Yeah, there it is. That sucks, bro. What's he gonna do to retaliate? What's the matter? Uh, it's not like home. I get people to notice if I don't get back. I had the day off. I thought if you want to go to the beach or go to the pier tonight. Uh, actually, I have a thing. Oh, shut yeah, up. Houston's dad's being honored by some magazine. They're having a cocktail party at the Cohen house. Invite uh, You wanna come? Yes, my boy. I think you want to go. I know what these things are like for me. I don't want to go. I just want to make sure you're not embarrassed to bring me to your things. How? What, what would he be embarrassed? No offense. Good. I have nothing to wear anyway. But come over after and we can both wear nothing. Uh, she's going to die. If this is Trio, Eddie would bust down the door and probably shoot her. Hold a hostage first for about two episodes and then shoot her. <laughs> that never happened in Trio, but it sounds like something that would happen in Trio. The hostage thing. That's real. Ah, oh, he's drunk most of the time. Can't take anything he says very seriously. We're taking what we think he has to say very seriously. I do, I don't mind the storyline, but it feels like they've half assed the whole Sandy teaming up with Jimmy storyline. It's been two eps. What's going on? Same with Jimmy hooking up with Kirsten's sister. Like, what's going on there? I tried, and uh, she gave me a list of reasons why she's leaving. You didn't make the cut, did you? But she's lying. I want her to know that you know. You're in there, Seth. I'm sure you're in there somewhere. Coming. Eddie, with a gun. <laughs> I'm so hell bent on Eddie shooting someone. Hey, come in. Oh. How are you? Hey, Good. Eddie. What's going on? Well, there's this party tonight, and I heard. Yeah, well, I thought maybe you'd want to go. Why would you invite Teresa? Why have you come here to invite Teresa? That. Well, I have some options. It's annoying because Marissa's being nice, but it's like, what are we doing? In what world do you go and invite the woman that your ex is hooking up with? I don't know. Under these circumstances, at least. Mafia, father, kicking. 
swollen on the inside. <laughs> then we have a deal. Why spend a lot of money when you can make a lot of money? Yeah, Caleb will be pleased. Yes, Miss McEwen, I'm fully aware. We do what we must. Sound like a threat. Teresa coming? Nope. She better. Teresa? I doubt it. Uh, they're both coming, actually, so. Look, I get why you're doing what you're doing. But she does really love you. No. Summer back in her, I respect that. But hey, she dated Luke for years. You can't always trust her judgment. <laughs> Old Luke. Current Luke's a catch. You were. Uh... Wow. Wild to. I had some help. Okay, well, it's straight up just to her. I thought they were going to do the good, like, oh, thanks. They both say thanks or something. You are the future of the company. Oh, there's something to look forward to. <laughs> we'll go out of comic books at some stage. I grow into wanting to be rich. No, I won't. Uh, yes, I can't wait. Actually, she did, she show up. I just came to say goodbye, and my plane's leaving soon. No! Yeah. Well, you might not believe this, but I'm going to miss you. No. What's even more unbelievable is that I'm going to miss you. Pretty unbelievable. They could have done so much. What are they doing? Have you seen Molly Miller's boob job? They're huge. Molly Miller. That was Robin's facelift. Wow. Diane Kahn, totally had chin implants. Do you have anything else to talk about? Can to say goodbye to Seth? Yeah. She's not going to. Could you give him this? this and... <sighs> I was supposed to say everything that I couldn't say, but now that I'm here, I just can't say anything at all. Yeah. This sucks. I hate this so much. Thanks for teaching me how to waltz. I have the best life. You deserve it. You deserve it, Anna. She still loves him. Tell me I'm wrong. You look so hot. Not here, Luke. But no, let's do this storyline instead of giving Anna her own storyline. Let's do Julie and Luke as a romance. Ah, okay. Jimmy's watching. Oh, Jimmy. Jimmy Neutron? Yep. I know I could rely on you. Not if you were man of the century. What's the matter, Sandy? You cut deals for your clients all the time. Yeah, well, usually they're the ones that have broken the law. Not me. <laughs> James. Now forgive me. This James can't possibly be happening, right? I mean, I'm, I'm, I'm crazy to even think it, right? Think what? Oh. That's what I thought. Because it would destroy Marissa. Is this is the fact is so bad as it is? Like it's so bad as it is, but then it's like the cherry on top of it all is it's her daughter's ex. It's like. <laughs> Oh. There he is, gone. He's waiting for you to roll up. Has he got a bomb? Oh, I thought he had like a detonator or something. Of course, my story has its own cast of characters. Ryan, you have crossed me for the final time. Only grandson Seth. I'm done. Are you sure? My favorite, I mean. There we go, let's cause a scene. You stay the hell away from me, okay? You're lucky I don't kick your ass right here. Look, the enemy, please just go. Go, 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 go. Oh, no. Oh, God. Because <laughs> of a dramatic punch ever. What the hell is going on? Oh, okay. Oh. Oh. John Luke, get involved. There it is. Oh, man. <laughs> just floating in the water. <laughs> that's so dramatic. Oh, that's gonna be quite a shiner. But hey, they look good on you. Yeah, thanks. <laughs> I'm so sorry. I can't believe Anna didn't show. Uh, actually, um. Uh... Oh no! 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 Are you no! Just giving no, me no. this now. I was a little distracted. It's gonna be ruined. The ink's all smudged. I can't even read it. Don't pain me. First, that says I love you. But then, what is that word right there? Azerbaijan, Aztecs. Aspirin. You think it's aspirin? No. You're giving me a headache. Okay, coincidence? <laughs> Confucius? What does this you want? Last week, you're standing on a coffee cart declaring your eternal love for me. Now you're all like, that is letter. Summer. I can't read it. This isn't like that, okay? She's just my friend. Yeah, I don't think it's like he's still in love with her or anything. Then go. Yeah. I think he does, like, he does still care about her. Hey, man. Uh, I'm sorry to interrupt. I need you to drive me to the airport. I gotta stop Anna from leaving. Well, you can't drive yourself? Dude, yes. I've had, like, 
three glasses of champagne, okay? You know how it goes straight to my head. Please. <laughs> three whole glasses, oh my god. Yeah, I'm in the motel when I get back. I don't want you to be late. Why do I get the impression that Therese is gonna leave now? I don't know. Hey, Juju. Right. I was wondering if you're gonna ignore me all night. You seem busy. Congratulations. Thanks for coming. Can I drive you home? I can walk down the driveway. Yeah. <laughs> I called you. Take you out on a real date. Oh, right. Oh, thank God now he's asking on a real date. I want to make you feel appreciated. Plan the perfect date? Run it by me. We'll see. Ooh. Tune. <laughs> Go get Anna, let's go! This is music. Do not insult Jack. Alright? <laughs> yeah, I won't hear it. It's a bang, I don't even care. Hey. God, you two are hanging out more than either of you hang out with Ryan. I can't believe it. This huge fight at a fancy party. Actually, not the first time that's happened. <laughs> yeah, it's really not. I'm not gonna have time to get it dry cleaned before I go. Before you go? Yeah, I'm just leaving under it. I've been fooling myself, thinking this was going to be easy. Are we going to lose Anna and Teresa in the same episode? I will stop watching. I have this whole life to figure out, and so does Ryan. So. Ugh. Take care of him. I, I want Teresa to stay because she clearly has more chemistry with Ryan, so I want that for the romance. I want Anna to stay just so she can have her own storyline. <laughs> she can be friends with someone, just give her something else to do, but instead of, like, Jules and Luke and all this crap, oh, whatever. I told you that I didn't want you to get involved. I will always do what's best for my family. I'd rather go to jail than be responsible for you being mixed up in this. Getting into bed with my father. I promise you, I'd rather send you to jail than get into bed with your father. <laughs> you do something like this, there's no going back. Yeah. Oof. I feel like this is going to have bad consequences towards the end of the season. If anybody's going to be putting you under handcuffs, is it going to be me? <laughs> Oh, I see you, Sandy. The Sandinator. Get him out, then. Yes, go get him back. Good luck. <laughs> yes. What are you doing here? Okay. Just. Maybe it's just the champagne talking, but I'm just going to say, okay? Please do not leave because of me. What? No, it's not gonna be it's not gonna be that. I love you. As a friend. What? <laughs> God, I love you as a friend. It doesn't say Azerbaijan. Oh no. <laughs> Look, I think you're an amazing guy. A little self absorbed. A little self absorbed, yeah. We don't have a lot of chemistry. So you're not leaving because of me? What? Because I need to leave. I do believe, yeah, I don't but believe this is... But who knows, maybe one day we'll be perfect for each other. Oh my god, imagine. I don't know. Imagine. I do know I have to go to Pittsburgh. She better come back in like season two or something. Thanks for coming. Oh. These two, I know what you're all going to say, I know Summer's great, but these two to me just feel like... They should end up together. I know. I know they're not. I know for a fact they're not. But that's how I feel. It's like, oh, bro, oh, that's such a waste. What am I gonna do without you? Oh, who am I gonna play Jenga with? You're so wise and all your sage wisdom. What am I gonna do without that? Confidence. What a waste? Such a waste of a character. Boo. No! What have you done? Oh, I hate that. I'm right back. Oh, you all knew this was coming as well. And Teresa's gone as well. That's the worst case scenario. <laughs> they both have left. I am going to search if they come back. I don't know. Do I search if they come back into the show? Actually, I have summer now. But our a little Seth Ryan time on the books. That's quality time. Thanks, buddy. I could always hang out with Luke. 
Yeah, 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 I wonder, I wonder. Shaving his chest with a black knife. They should do that together. I do think Ryan should become part of the trio at this point. Um, I'm going on try. I want to see what everyone's saying about it. If no one mentions Anna, I'm going to be sad. I can't believe she just left. The app's called The Goodbye Girl. I mean, that could work for her and Teresa. Sad to see Anna go. She was so cool. And I like Teresa, even though I really didn't see how she would fit in that world. Anna is such a wasted character. Like, she was just part of a thruple. Yeah, I feel like that's, like, the wasted potential with Anna is... It felt like there was more to her than just being in a love triangle with Seth and Summer. Like, I thought when they ended the relationship with Anna and Seth, and it was Summer and Seth, it's like, okay, cool. But then I thought Anna would kind of go on to do her thing, like, have her own storyline. Like, she'd been in the show enough at that point to then warrant just her having her own personal storyline. Uh, and they never really did that, and she just kind of left now. So, I don't know. I'm not, not a fan of that. You guys knew I wasn't going to be a fan of that, because Anna's one of my favourites. Um, if she comes back into it, fair enough. Uh, we shall see. Like, I don't see her coming back anytime this season if she was to, but maybe in season two or something. That'd be quite cool. Uh, kind of like how they do with Jess in Gilmore Girls, where he just kind of pops up every now and again. But uh, I really thought maybe she'd stick around and then end up being a main character. Uh, like, and again, we're just wasting time with, like, Julian, Luke. It's like, why do we have that storyline, but then Anna's is to leave? Did the actress leave because she had another show to go to? Or did they write her out? I don't know if anyone knows why that happened but yeah that that really sucks um everything else though was pretty good i do like that Seth actually went to anna and if this is the last we see of anna at least it felt like an actual goodbye but then also i would be pissed because why wouldn't seth and anna keep in contact and all that stuff so uh i i'll be pissed if that's the last we'll see of it but uh yeah we'll see and then what else Oh, Teresa and Ryan, their chemistry is great. Uh, and then the Sandy storyline. I didn't mind the Sandy storyline so far. I think I need a bit more with it. But again, I just thought I thought we were doing Sandy and Jimmy. I mean, they could still do the Sandy and Jimmy opening a restaurant, but it's like I don't want him to just forget about it. And then in the finale of the season, they're like, and the restaurant's open. It's just like, okay, well, <laughs> no, we'll we'll see on that one as well, I guess. So Teresa, I'm assuming, is going to come back as well. If that's the last week see if Teresa or the last we see until season two that would annoy me as well so I think this is one of those episodes where I'm like I need to wait and see what happens with some of these storylines before I really judge it but as of right now I'm going to go a 7.4 out of 10 I think it's another really good episode I think we ha it has been a while since we've had an outright great great episode um, which is surprising because like I say we were on such a roll it's still at 14 was the last one for me um, so, yeah, but still, like I say, really good episode. So, thanks for watching, guys. Leave a like if you enjoyed. Let me know the episode down below in the comments. And I'll see you next time for episode 22. Until then, take care. Peace.